Hey guys, Christian here. I just want to give you a quick update. As you probably know from the title, I'm going to delete my website, thedigitallife.com, or better, I already did it when you're watching this video. Now, for those of you who don't know what I'm talking about, besides this YouTube channel, I also built a website, thedigitallife.com, where I created posts according to some of my videos, mainly tutorials where I was showing many commands and instructions. The idea was to have a reference or a technical document documentation for whatever I was teaching and showing in my videos. I've really invested a lot of time and effort into that. I don't know how many hours I've sat there working on the design of the website, maintaining the server, doing all the legal stuff. But finally, after two and a half years, I've decided to shut it down because this has just become too much of a burden for me and yeah, ultimately too much work and struggle. The recent incident that I had which forced me to take a break of YouTube that has shown me that I needed to focus more on stuff that really matters to me, my family, my mental and physical health and start prioritizing the things in my life. Otherwise the result is just chaos and it doesn't really help anyone. By the way, thank you all so much for the support when I apologize that I needed to take a longer break. I've got so many friendly comments and sympathies from you guys and I just want to say Thank you for that. I actually didn't expect it. I'm now, I would say, on a good path. Still not in shape as it was before, but as you can see, I'm at least able to make videos again from time to time. And I know the shutdown of my website, which has been a place for all my written tutorials and command references, yeah, it's not what you want to hear from me, but... I think it's a necessary step and don't worry, of course, I will continue doing write-ups and documentation for all my videos. I just won't put them on a website anymore. For this, I believe I found even a better and more comfortable way doing this. Let me show you that. For all the write-ups and documentation in my videos, I've now created a new Git repository called Videos. That's running on GitHub. And under every new tutorial video here on YouTube, you will now find a direct link to a folder in this repository. I'm maintaining all upcoming projects here with detailed instructions, commands, project files and whatever is needed to follow the video. This is much less work for me than maintaining a website where I needed to reformat everything to HTML or manage a server in the cloud. Yeah, even all the legal stuff that you need to take care of like privacy policies, GDPR, all the burden that comes with running a website. This is now completely gone. On GitHub, I can can just take my documentation stuff, push it into the repository and then I'm done. But what this is also perfect for and this wasn't even possible on my old website. If you now want to follow one or more tutorials, you simply can clone this repository on your machine and use that as a code snippet or starting template to work on your own projects. You even get updates when you pull any changes from this repo. This is really amazing. And if you found a mistake, because yeah, I'm making many mistakes, you don't need to write a YouTube comment or something like that you can directly raise an issue on github so that means you can add a description you can add code blocks which contain your own configs logs whatever and you can even attach screenshots and then not only me but also you so other people within our community who have followed these tutorials you can all take a look to help out each other maybe work in a collaborative way on this repository that would be so great so I hope you're cool with this change. As you can see, this isn't actually bad news about my dying website. I believe this is a good change. It is still a lot of work too, but it's not so terrible like running a website. And before I end this video, I just want to announce a second thing, my updated Patreon page where you can financially support me. So this will help me to continue working on all these projects and make great videos and even expand on that. But please don't, don't feel pushed by me in any way to do this. You know, I still have my main job and I'm okay. But if you feel the content here that I make is helping you in any way and you want to just give something back, Patreon is really the best way to do it. And you will now find a link in the description of this and every other video as well. Yeah, I guess that is everything for today. If there is anything more you want to discuss or share with me, just ping me on Discord or Twitter or even Instagram. You know where to find me. And thanks again, everybody, for watching, following my videos. I will see you in the next video. Take care, everyone. Bye bye.